Hi, I'm Jenny. Welcome to my channel, Beauty in a Minute. If you are new here, welcome. I post a video every Monday and Thursday, and most of my skincare videos are only five minutes long. And if you haven't done so, consider subscribing to my channel. And if you like my video today, please kindly give me a thumbs up. I would so appreciate that. And today, I want to talk about another, another Paula's Choice product. Yes, I am a big fan of this brand because I find that, number one, they work. They really do work. And number two, I find her products are so reasonably priced because clinical skincare brands with active ingredients or peptides, they're not cheap. Really, they aren't. And I find that her products are just affordable, really, for the quality of ingredients that she puts in them. So today, a new Paula's Choice product uh, that I have tried for a couple of months now, and that is the um, Omega Plus Complex Serum. Omega Plus Complex Serum. So, hang on. <laughs> there you are. Uh, the color of the, uh, the tube is, is uh, a light blue in color. It has the three omegas, yeah, three omegas, omega-3, omega-6, omega-9 oils. It has the four ceramides. I'm just going to read them to you. I'll put on my glasses. So the three omegas, um, the linoleic acid, which is your omega-6 fatty acid. And then, you, and then your linolenic acid, which is your omega-3 fatty acid, the chia seed oil, which is your omega-3 fatty acid, the linseed oil or the flaxseed oil, that one has omega-3, 6, and 9 fatty acids, ceramide EOP, ceramide EOS, ceramide NP, ceramide NS. So with this product, the two main ingredients is your omega-3, 6, and 9 oils um, in the form of your linoleic, linolenic acids, and so forth. And then the, the four ceramides. So it's the combinations of ceramide and omega fatty acids. I'm just going to squeeze a little bit out for you to show you what it looks like. So it's just, it's serum me. It's a very... When I say serum, I mean the texture is not cream-like. The texture is a very soft, soft, watery cream. So it's a serum. It's very, it's the, the fragrance is very neutral. There's no scent at all. What I find with this serum is, on its own, if I put this just straight onto my skin, on its own, it doesn't do much. Personally, yeah, that's the disappointing part. On its own, it doesn't do much. It really is. So what I find this product is good for is to put this on top of my vitamin A, B, or C. Putting it on top of my active ingredients, ingredients like retinol, niacinamide, and vitamin C. On its own, I can't see. If I just put it on it on its own on my skin, I honestly can't see any extra hydration or it does hydrate my skin, it does moisturize my skin, but it doesn't do the brightening, the lightening, the evening out of the skin tone. That's a secondary hydrating product that I put on top of my active ingredients. This is very good. So if you want to get the most benefit of this product, um, my suggestion is to put this on top of your vitamin C, um, niacinamide, which is vitamin B, or your retinol. And so you have your two serum, and then you can have your moisturizer and sunblock. So that's my verdict for this product. Yeah, on, on its own, I don't see much difference. On its own, I'm a bit disappointed. Australian $37 for 30 mils uh, from paulaschoice.com.au in Australia. That's where I purchase all my Paula's Choice products. I know there's a lot of products to purchase, but I always um, wait for Paula's Choice to have a sale on, like a 15% uh, site-wide discount. That's where I stock up my 
favorite serums. Um, so this works out to be 41, 42 New Zealand dollars, which to me for a 30 mil serum is very reasonable. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you haven't done so, please consider subscribing to my channel. And if you like my video today, please give me the thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.